everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today I am super duper excited to show you this brand new amp from Laney. This is the Laney Lionheart Foundry Super 60 1x12 combo and this thing has a list of features as long as your arm but seriously before we get into it just look at this thing. It is beautiful. From top to bottom it is shiny and new and glorious. It is absolutely lovely looking piece of uh, Laney equipment. Now I'd also like to thank Laney very much for sending this over. For us to play around with, I've had days and days of fun mucking around with it and I'll be very sad when I have to send it back. So uh, anyway, this thing is great. I'll go through the features. It, it's a long list, so brace yourselves. All right. It's 60 watts, or you can run it in one watt mode if you, uh, you know, are practicing inside the house, you don't wanna wake up the baby, that's always handy. It's got a clean channel and it's got a dirty channel. It's got foot switchable boost. It's got a full analog signal path. It's got this specially designed uh, 12 inch foundry uh, driver in it or speaker in it. It uh, sounds bloody great in here. It's it's, uh, it's nice and loud and nice and thumpy, just the way I like it. Now, it's also got chorus built into it. So that's from the Spiral Array pedal. They've uh, taken the chorus out of the Black County Customs um, spiral array and put it into this amp to muck around with us. Also has the reverb from the secret path or one of the reverbs from memory. I think the secret path has three different reverb algorithms in it. This style taking one of those from that. It's got reverb built into it, chorus. It also has a tremolo built into it, which is awesome. Um, it's got an effects loop. In the effects loop today, I have this uh, space echo from Boss. You can see it there on the board. And I've also got the nobles there, which I'm punching into the front of it. I'll punch it in later so we can all see how, it, while it takes a drive pedal, I figured the uh, nobles was just, um, you know, pretty run of the mill pedal that lots of, lots of us would have. It's got an auxiliary in so that you can, uh, you know, punch some tunes into it and play along with it, backing tracks or a drum beat or something like that. It's got a headphone out for complete silent uh, performance so you can practice it again without waking up the baby. It's also got on the back a XLR output so you can go straight into your door or the front of house or something like that into a mixing desk. And it's got the ability to run no IR at all, so you're just getting amp noise, or you can run a built-in one by 12 IR or a four by 12 IR. I've got the four by 12 IR cabinet on now. Sounds great. So uh, you're gonna be hearing a combination of uh, condenser microphone and IR today because, uh, you know, I've got the ability to show you both at the same time, why not? It's, a, it's just an incredibly flexible way to uh, to be able to use your amplifier, which is awesome. So, we'll go through it. This is the clean channel. Now, it was impossible for me to get a camera angle of the knobs in real time um, because there's so many lights in here it was just reflecting off the shiny metal surface so I can't I haven't got a camera to show you all the knobs as I'm turning them but I'll show you on the screen which one I'm touching so the clean channel just has a volume it also has this little switch which I'll show you on the screen now that's a bright switch Bright switch off. Bright switch on. Bright switch off now while I'm here. Punch the drive back into the front of it so you can all hear what it sounds like. Now this red knob here is also the boost. Boost back off. Boost back on. Now I've only got that up to sort of three or four there, the boost. I'll turn the boost right up when we get to the dirty channel. Right, this is the dirty channel. Got 
got a separate volume and a separate gain. That's the gain almost all the way off. Oh, that's the gain all the way up. and heaps of gain on tap. All right, let me bring that back down. Right, clean channel, dirty channel. Oh, it's got heaps of volume. So that's with the gain all the way up. Now I'm gonna boost, use the boost on this, the red knob. I've just turned on the space echo in the effects loop. amount of gain on tap there if you are, you know, if you're brave enough. Okay, I've just come, come back to the nice clean channel. Right, uh, there's bass, metal and treble. They're all pretty self-explanatory. Treble off. Treble up. Mids all the way up. Nice scoopy mids. Bass all the way up. Bass all the way off. That is very, very cool. Nice tone stack there. There is an overall tone knob as well. Just sort of around that, it sounds like I don't know where it is in there, upper mids. And that's got a nice little notch in the top of the uh, of the knob as well, so you know exactly where the halfway mark is, which is really handy. Good work, Lenny. takes uh, overdrive into the front of it like an absolute champ, so. All right, next we have the reverb. I've been running it this whole time on about four. But it does go all the way up. Oh. It's a really lovely reverb. And of course it goes all the way off. 
So it's as dry as a dead dingo's donger. <laughs> For those of you that are familiar with the channel, uh, for those of you who aren't, hi, here you go, I'm Matt, this is the Pedal Picassos. Uh, I do like my sounds, for those of you that are familiar, I do like my sounds uh, pretty wet. Lovely, lovely reverb. Like I said, from the um, from the uh, secret path pedal, that reverb is from a secret path pedal, and it's lovely. Really, really nice. Okay. Now, because it's a Laney, uh, there's always a couple of tricks up its sleeve. And this particular amp has a uh, chorus and it has tremolo as well, which is, you know, if it's, they're both foot switchable on the back of the amp. If, if, if it saves you from bloody having to carry extra pedals around. If you're that way inclined, it's awesome. So pretty much with the clean channel, the dirty channel, the boost, the reverb, the chorus, and the tremolo. And with a couple of foot switches, you could seriously just uh, gig this bad boy all by itself. So, uh... All right, I've hit the switch now. It's, again, I can't show it to you. I can show you on the screen this way, but I can't show it to you live because I just cannot get the camera to uh, focus. The face plate with all the um, with all the knobs and everything on it is so shiny and there's so many lights in the studio here, it's just, all it is doing is reflecting lights and you can't see what I'm doing. So, so that's as fast as it goes and as deep as it goes. Copyright strike. So that's the trim low. It's very, very cool. I'll turn it back up again. Now this is the uh, chorus that also has built into it from the Spiral Array pedal from Black County Customs. Geez, I'm trying hard to get uh, copyright strikes today, aren't I? Lovely sounding chorus. I hate using buzzwords, but there's just no other way to describe it. It's it's syrupy and lush and chorusy. I really hope that's coming through into your headphones or whatever you're uh, watching. Absolutely love it. So there's a three-way toggle switch there. Up is for the tremolo, down is for the chorus, in the middle is everything off. 
Now I've turned the reverb off, so I'm back to being as dry as it did Dingo's Donger. And I've got this space echo in the effects loop. I'm pretty sure it's the last thing I need to show you. Tails turned on on the space echo so Even when I turn it off, it's still going to be coming through. A uh, bit of dirt as well in the front of the amp. So I've got the nobles going into the front of the amp, and then I've got this space echo in the effects loop. That sounds a million bucks. Uh, well done, Laney. So this, hopefully, this video has come out on the day it's supposed to come out, uh, which is the 28th of June, uh, 2024. It's it's actually May when I've got this amp, but uh, I've got to send it back, unfortunately, because there's a few other people that need to have a play around with it. But hopefully, if you are looking for an amp that really does a bit of everything, which sounds great, and seriously, look at this thing. It just looks so beautiful. It's a beautiful color. I hope it's coming across and how nice that blue is and uh, the sort of bony, tanny uh, grill on the front or tweed, whatever they call it, I'm not sure. I probably should look that up before I started filming, but um, this is just an amazing amp from Laney. So uh, well done, you guys. If you have got this far, thank you for hanging in there. This is gonna be a pretty long video. Uh, give us a thumbs up and a like and a subscribe, leave a comment, anything like that really, really helps the channel out. We really appreciate it. And we appreciate you, Laney, for, uh, Sending this amp, sending us this amp to have a muck around with, it's been a lot of fun. And to be honest, I'm really a little bit sad it has to go back. Uh, but anyway, thank you for tuning in. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.